one I've seen oh I guess besides the courage one I was just talking about was uh, maybe the pirate one holy shit scooby-doo pirates of Hawaii I think so. engineering log <laughs> holy shit the movie came out in like 2007 that sounds about <laughs> in line with the last time I watched the scooby-doo movie so yeah holy shit yeah, let's see, when did Scooby Doo Pirates Hawaii come out? Two thousand six. Yeah, okay. That one and the mummy one. The mummy one before or after that one. It makes no sense. It was before. That's what I thought. like the last couple. We're tethered to a four trillion time. Yeah, the Scooby Doo Where's My Mummy one. It's dragging us down to the planet. In 2003. Sure. No, that doesn't make sense. Twist is a little weird. Do a full restart. But you'll need the stabilizer. It makes sense. Oh, no, the, the cyber chase came out in 2001. Really? Hold on, I, I'm just trying to base this off memory. Uh oh. Let's see. Hold I would have guessed 90s. Oh, 2005. Oh, okay. Cyber chase? No, no, oh. the Where's My Mummy oh, one. Okay. That was gonna throw me for a loop. <laughs> and then, sorry, geez. 2000. 2001. Yeah, okay. Ripper, baby. <laughs> like how the implication is. I didn't notice this last time, but the implication is that he got killed by his own gun somehow. How's that even possible? Bad shot. <laughs> Dion Warwick and Burt Bacharach songs? Rest in peace, Burt Bacharach. I think he just died. Oh, uh, really? Rest in peace, he's in the fucking. That's the awesome 93. Powers movies. Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Burt Bacharach. <laughs> so funny. <laughs> Those movies are fucking hilarious. I would even argue. The best spoof movies of all time. I yeah, like the scary good. movies, and I like the Naked Guns, and I like the... Actually, I only like the first Naked Gun. I watched the third one kind of recently, and it was shit. Um, and only like the first three scary movies are good. I, I don't like the second or one. two. Personally. Okay. Well, there's some funny stuff in the second one, because that's the one of Tim Curry. <laughs> Tim Curry's funny. Um, but the third and fourth one of Charlie Sheen are actually really good, at least in my opinion. It's been a while since I've seen them. I know the fifth one wasn't. The fifth one's a pile of doo doo. Because they, they started making it too. Uh, like yeah, like almost too shitty. jokey. Yeah. Plus, they changed their ratings and all that, and they just completely fucked it up. No, the first one. Oh. Yeah, I, I mean, what's up? Literally became almost bigger than Scream itself. <laughs> yeah, you know it's bad when the parodies are bigger than the actual thing. You know what? I watched them back to back, kind of recently, and it parodies it like way closer than you'd think. Like it's almost like beat for beat. <laughs> the same movie. See, but it's not stealing because it's in a. A parody manner. I've used that many a time to get out of copyright strikes on YouTube. Let's tell you, uh, have you ever seen the show Nathan for You? Yes! The dumb Starbucks. Yeah, the fucking. That guy's a genius. That show is hilarious. 
Have you seen the, um, the ghost, like, real estate agent one? Yeah. That is the best. Like, like the weird, like, twist to where, like, the real estate agent all of a sudden is, like, claiming she had an experience with a ghost. And you can see Nathan, like, almost break. He's like, what the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> you were raped by a ghost. That is so funny. <laughs> and like, and then like, like the guy keeps trying to do like his like uh, exorcism thing, but then Nathan like knowing this is a comedic goes like, no, 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 let's go back to what you said about you. Uh, you met a ghost. <laughs> <laughs> In the one he had uh, fucking, he printed a, a model of the guy's face and pretended to be him. Uh, what was what was the gag? What was it for? He was because this one guy was. Trying to get a girlfriend or whatever, or no, he wasn't popular, so he was gonna tightrope across a building for a charity to get it as someone else. I don't think I've seen that one. That sounds amazing. <laughs> tightrope across a building. So he spent like a year practicing tightrope <laughs> <laughs> to not even get credit for it. Um, you've seen the pawn shop one? Like, it's like, the way to, like, boost the sales is to, like, let drunk people come in and break shit, and then they'd have to pay for the stuff. <laughs> yeah. And then, like, the guy he gets, like, drives him home, or he drives the guy home, and he, like, he tells him some story about him and his brother with, like, tag team girls, and it's like, what is happening? <laughs> The one, it was like a gas rebate too, where they did whatever and it's like, oh guys, there's, there's no rebate or something, but Ed, the way that he ends the show is like, but business is business, and then it zooms in on the gas rebate sign because they, <laughs> after they couldn't find it, oh. they all could have gotten the rebate, but they didn't. Them. Did you see the, um, I'm not sure why I do that again. Did you see the, like, the finale? Like, the long-ass documentary? Yeah. That is genuinely heartbreaking, and I love it. Yeah, it was really interesting. It's, like, like so different than everything else, but it's, like, really good. <laughs> As a fucking Steve Jobs, or not Steve Jobs, so. the Bill Gates impersonator. I vaguely remember that. What was, like, the point of getting him? Uh, because they were making a, a video for some store in Venice. Oh, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. It was like a, uh, like a souvenir shop, right? Something. Yeah, something like that. Then he made another show called The Rehearsal. I watched that. <laughs> the fact that he 3D scanned this man's apartment and built oh for the the door part a spot on <laughs> it's like, replica it's like doorception or whatever you say that shit is <laughs> yeah shoes on shirt off <laughs> I I mean I liked like the whole thing I think the first episode was the best though it starts to get a little too insane at the end I'm like what the fuck where he's like actually messing with this kid's psyche. That lady was the worst. Oh, that lady was the worst. Oh, it, 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 it. oh shit, nice shooting it, I think. He's blowing me, Carrot. Yeah, but the fact fucking. not I mean, I wasn't sure he got the show out of it, but he went through so much effort to help that chick, like, prepare to be a mom, and she's like, eh. Well, she's the bitch about it. Yeah, really funny. Especially because it ended up being because he was Jewish or whatever. Ugh. So embarrassing. So, how do you do that? Not be funny and still be a cunt <laughs> on TV, and then not even have like a real reason. And then some of the crazy shit she was saying to the 
We just wasted an hour. I guess she wasn't a rabbi. Now we need to restart the cell refueling station, but some jackass turned off the power. Teacher, lady, saying some fucked up shit. No engines. We're gonna hit planet fall soon. What now? I think another season might be coming. I'd imagine. It'd probably take him a while though, because fucking mad at effort you put, not to mention like <laughs> building <laughs> the canes and the bar and everything, but like teaching a whole acting class and all the other crazy shit. And then teaching an acting class that spoofing another class that he was teaching. <laughs> That's right, I forgot about that. The, it got really meta. <laughs> He's fucking genius, dude. Just like in its own way. I wish he had um, fallen in love with that prostitute. I was really rooting for him. And then he made it in the one as like no smoking the show. Or smoking aloud the show. I don't know if I've seen that one. Thank God. Like, no, that was pretty fun. I barricaded myself in the computer core. I can hear them, but I don't think they know I'm here. Isaac, I've tracked down your rig. You're an engineer, right? I'll get myself admin privileges. Maybe I can help. And then the Canes one? That that other dude was kind of an asshole, because he just, like, left. That, okay, that one might have been the best, because where he has the guy think that the dude, um, like the grandpa that like, died after he like had him dig for gold or whatever. It's just so crazy. I don't, I don't remember that one. It was where like the guy had like have a talk with his brother about how, it was in the, um, the rehearsal. Where like he had to have his brother give him like some of the dad's inheritance and he didn't have the conversation or something yet. And to help him get ready for it, he wanted like the actor who was playing his brother to have suffered a recent loss that was similar to his own brother's loss. So he had him go meet the guy's like fake grandpa, who like has like a day with him. And then like he's like, ah, the next day, yeah, the guy, uh, he died. <laughs> Just like, Holy shit. I really hope he makes another season. Should still be. It's just top tier quality. It's only. That shows us it's only second to the stream. Oh, man. That's why I'm afraid to show you. Unironically, it was way better than a lot of the vampire shows we've seen. Mm -hmm. Like, People. better than Vampire Diaries. Oh, I don't even know any pirate vampire shows. Well, Midnight Mass is one, but. I have a whole video getting into that, so don't get me started. Refuel the engines north. Is that across the way? I guess it is. It's across the way. Go back on the gondola. See, why I'm not afraid of enemies attacking us, even though I feel like this would be a great place for enemies to attack us, is because we already did this and thought we were going to get attacked, but didn't get attacked. There's a level of the level. Imagine this time we get attacked. <laughs> we're just going to get sniped. I think we're going quicker than last time. I mean, 
I'd hope so. Embarrassing if it weren't. Get wrecked. Is that it? Alright. Level two. Get on my level. Get on my level. Uh, where is the thing? I mean, where are my pants? Here they are. Show's over. Now he's playing Mario. What? Is that a joke? <laughs> no, Chris Pratt's playing Mario now. Oh, well, that is a joke in itself. Yeah, that that whole thing. Shit. It's a me, a Chris Pratt. <laughs> I still need to get the centrifuge working before we start. Uh, anytime now. <laughs> they need to make a live action one with Pedro Pascal. <laughs> Did you see? I've seen you saw the Saturday Night Live skit. Yeah. Like, I feel like if you kept that quality level, I, I feel like it'd be. It'd be kind of bad, but fun. Well, it'd be like time. purposely be worth bad. Watching. It'd be like enjoyable bad. Yeah. Kind of like scary movie. Okay. Oh, I forgot there's another one of these things spawns. I came, I saw, I conquered. Ben of Benavici? Now just to tie it back to uh, old Augustus and Shakespeare came with that genius quote. Because you know, there was Charles Lundgren. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Charles Lundgren. With the famous more. quote, Ben of Benavici. <laughs> This is the part, okay. This is the part coming up that uh, I may or may not have died at the first time I played through. No. Does this look like Harry Potter? <laughs> This would be a, a strange Harry Potter game. No, it's the scary game. It's called Dead Space. Well, we have to go around this ship, just trying to make the room more ergonomically efficient. I play it. Harry Potter's gonna be fun. It is. Well, just from what I played, it's fine. I'm gonna fucking like blow my vocal cords out then. Oh, shoot! I didn't think that was gonna happen. It's even the point of being able to do that. Just here, so I don't get fined. Well, it's like it's not like we can't we can climb through that. I think maybe it's because enemies can pop through, and maybe you can like jump scare the enemies by shooting through it first. Contamination. 
That's the room I think no. Things almost maxed out. Special two. Hmm. I know there was a special one. Hopefully, we didn't miss it. We had the first time. Do not remember where it is. Alright, this is the room I thought the other room was supposed to be. We have to like wait for the shower shower. It's getting wet. You know, it's also getting us rusty. So <laughs> what if we just rusted shut and <laughs> Kinda like the tin man. Yeah. See that guy? I thought you were just shooting at the floor. He lost his mind! Yeah, I was thinking you're just They're wasting this over. Ah. Just blowing these guys' knees out. Ooh, it's a walrus. I am the walrus. Cuckoo, cachoo! <laughs> I don't know how true this story is, but I saw something that some kid was writing a paper for school or for like a university and how uh, like how Beatles songs were easy to interpret, okay. like the meaning the meaning behind them, and then like in, somehow John Lennon saw that what? and then made "I Am the Walrus." <laughs> Which just has the most just a bunch of gibberish for the most part. It's super random and all over the place. If that story is true, that's hilarious. It sounds like something John Lennon would do. Loki kind of an asshole, but. <laughs> See, that's how you know how good they were, though. Song like they just, like they were just writing random shit. I mean, I know this is true. They were on a shit ton of drugs around that time, so that also might have <laughs> had something to do with it. Yeah, but so all doped out and and fucked up, they can still shit gold. That's why there's never been other Beatles. Like, think about how much drugs Ozzy was on ah. back in the day. <laughs> Dude, he took enough drugs to fucking kill probably 15 people. Back in the day? Potentially still yeah. is? Maybe? Yeah, that's, that means somehow they made, he made some of the most fucking iconic people. And sounded relatively normal. At least when he was singing. Oh, okay, so yeah, this is the part where I died the first time, and it's also a puzzle that I spent way too much time trying to figure out that I should hopefully build the first try. What do you even do? You have to slow it down and then. Yeah, oh shit. I shouldn't even have to slow it down. I think you just have to it's, put it pretty close yeah, and then. then. Uh oh. Being 
do a bango bongo. That took me way too long the first time to do that. We saved about four and a half. Literally. Oh my hill! Hello my friends. I did not see you coming. There we go. FPS car. <laughs> Probably not, uh, not too mad that he got rid of that. Probably not now. Dude's such a doof. He still does his podcast. I don't listen to him, but I just heard all that. He just... He's got, like, really into weed, and it's, like, made it so he, like, just says nonsense. Like, all the time the podcast. Oh, doesn't he even do gun videos anymore? No, he got, he didn't hear about it. he got arrested for weed possession, and they claimed it was enough for a felony, so he legally can't own guns anymore. Wow, you really fucked that up. Like I said, dude's kind of an idiot, so I'm not going to about it. His gun videos were pretty f interesting. Hello, my friends. This is the best Today, I'm going to shoot some shit. Aside from the kind of a goofy accent and all that, but I like the whole bit of no. being Russian, or in quotes, Russian. When he got like kidnapped and it was all a gimmick for his app. I don't know about that. Well, that's a Wallace head, I think. Stranger Things portal. Centrifuge activated. Time to go. Establishing balance with tectonic load. Oh wait, I can't. Well, I was gonna fly myself upside down. I guess I can't fly upside down right now. There goes the joke. Looks like the centrifuge is back online. Right, so that's All the big thing that killed me last time. Right? Ready when you are. And if we had survived long enough to get here without dying, I would still have been flawless, but. Shit happened. Uh oh. <gasps> Yikes. Okay, if I had died there and I hadn't already died, I would have been pissed. So, it's a good thing. We already died twice before. Third time's a charm. I still feel like shit though. I'm playing like shit. This is definitely a lot more sloppy. Well, it's like faster, but yeah. sloppier. Yeah, give me credit, guys. I've already played this before. I'm trying to get to the new part as quick as possible. <laughs> Still taking like three hours. Okay, okay. Hold on. Oh, he's going too fast. Oh! Oh! <laughs> like, did he hit him? I guess it did. That f the first time was better. It's a shame people never see it. No, there's, there's more that spawn. Oh. Let's see if I can get him. <laughs> hey, there you go. Fuck, dude, that was close. And they say I'm not good at this game. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. I was no about one, to no say, like. I was about to say this, like, did you realize how fucking close you were to dying that first time? Looks like the centrifuge is back online. All that's left is restarting the engines, right? Ready when you are. You got cocky, Ro. Goodbye. <laughs> Never gets old. Yep, neither does this. <laughs> Oh, 
Ishimura. Dude, we're just, it's going off the rails. Call it third time's charm? Ready when you are. Call it six times charm? Oh, no. Oh, please, no. <laughs> what if I can, can I freeze you? I will. Well, well. Oh, goodbye. <laughs> it's just like no, a I'm already off times. Why can I freeze this thing? Buttons. Uh, I don't have a. I guess this. I had a shit ton of. Oh, <laughs> so dumb. Should have done the stasis because I have like. Oh, whatever. And if you guys want to know, we checked that last time. There's nothing there. Could have checked again, but we have to. We're a little time restricted since we yeah, died. Yeah, anymore. <laughs> what? Whoa! Whoa! Where did you come from? What? <laughs> That's weird. Okay. There we go. Two sixteen. Two fifty nine. So definitely faster. I don't remember exactly where. So, oh, I remember this though. Yeah, we were probably twenty minutes faster. Ah! Shit! Am I almost out of ammo? Oh my god! I just remember that gun melts this thing. Yeah, I should probably just do it. Z get go. I think I killed it faster. Didn't go this way. Oh, we did. We first did the first time we played. I forgot about it this time. Good thing I remembered because it's a node. My favorite. What is this? Oh, shit, I'm stupid. Um, my favorite mascot for Domino's Pizza, the Noid. You're from Wait, Wait, The what? Never heard of the ship. The noise? It's like this weird, like, small, like, purple guy in, like, a suit. You can, like, jump around. And it's called the Noid. Oh, actually, I, I, I think... It's before our time, about. but I've seen, like, videos of it. Yeah, I think I know what you're talking about. It's the Noid. I kind of want to upgrade her suit. Oh, this little motherfucker. I I remember him. <laughs> There's a Funko Pop of this asshole. Uh, yes, please. <laughs> it's on Amazon. How much is this shit? Thirty dollars. Whoa. Honestly, in retrospect, not too bad. Some of those Funko Pops are crazy. I have some crazy ones. I'm not flexing. You can get the uh, the big Kool-Aid guy, the Noid, and who is this? Hawaiian Punch guy. For Sixty bucks. Is the Kool-Aid guy just called Kool-Aid Man? <laughs> I 
think so. Oh yeah! <laughs> Am I right? Yep, Kool Aid Man. Well, how do you know he's a man? It's <laughs> just a pitcher full of liquid. Yeah, how do you know it's a man? He doesn't have any sort of genitalia. It's <laughs> just liquid. <laughs> Holy shit, this fucking Scooby Doo is. Holy crap, we have a lot of money. $40. Plasma cutter upgrade. Holy shit, Scooby Doo the fucking oh, red this must have been ghost. The thing. I must have bought it. What is this? Kinetic auto loader. Yeah, the Scooby Doo red beard's ghost is fucking two hundred dollars. Holy crap! Is he different than Captain Cutlass? Yeah. Yeah, the, uh, the Captain Cutler one is, he's in the big, or the, not the big, the, uh, that old scuba suit, like the big Oh, that's metal right, helmet. we talked about that last time. We're refreshing the memory bank. I think the last time we ignited the engines, and then... We did, you're right. And then that was it. Which, that might be it again, too. I'm falling with him. About to fall asleep. Oh, that's how... Oh, I forgot! This is why he's here. Like, this guy was here for a reason. Yep. <laughs> Why'd you go all the way through? That wasn't as satisfying as... Well, he dodged the blade somehow. You fucking launched him, that's like a thing. Something alien. Oh, that's right, you can freeze this. That was a little close. When the miners found the artifact, they reported hallucinations, paranoia, and chopped up slow motion. But the issue more brought this marker on board anyway. Like that was a plan. I don't need any more extraneous stupid deaths. Even though we know they're not coming. Right? Die! Thank you. Die, you need it. This is so Amazing content that we recorded. It's a dirty shame. And this has been some great content this time, though. Who am I kidding? Now we walk through the fleshy fun bridge. I didn't think we were in a suit. Imagine walking through this like, with your shirt. Ew. Did you be like wet? And sticky. And then you'd walk through the stuff. <laughs> I'm mad. Oh shoot, I forgot about that. Okay, be wet and sticky in the fucking. Oh, I didn't equip the Smith Fight Door. Log. My last 
Oh no, this is where Jacob dies. I can't raise anyone on Ripley. Well, to be fair, we don't know he died. He just said this is his last log. I found the Kinesis module that someone used to bust the centrifuge. Burned out. Who would sabotage Maybe we get to at a time like this? I I'm sure we'll find them. So if point. anyone's left. And then I'm finding Elizabeth and getting us the hell off this ship. He's gonna be in the bridge, probably. He was dead. And he referenced, I don't know if I remember catching this last time, that someone sabotaged the ship. This might be a traitor. A, a full Benedict Arnold, man. Hate that guy. <laughs> and a real We're just jerk. dropping all the history on this. Let's play. <laughs> The more I uh, read about this uh, Hitler guy, the more I think he's a real jerk. <laughs> <laughs> Classic Norm Macdonald for your pleasure. Can I shoot this one? Why is there like stuff behind me? Oh, slippery, slimy little rapscallion. Little saucer. Oh, shit. Hey, green light there. Here we go. Have you guys ever wanted whips in a hot dog? Now you know. Oh. Yep. Honestly, I wouldn't look that much different. Oh, can I flamethrower these things? Yep. I can't remember what those are supposed to be. Like little giblets? Okay. Oh! Oh, juicy stomp. Yeah. Get that juicy stomp, yeah. Equivalent of a Viking burial in this universe. You gotta make sure they're dead. Double tap. Oh! Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, that was It's with zombie land power. That and always buckle your seatbelt. And yep. never, ever be a hero. Beware of bathrooms. Huh? Enjoy the little things. That one was courtesy of Tallahassee. Oh, 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 I forgot about the big loader. Oh my god, he was full of these little. Oh my, oh my, oh my, oh my Lanta! Oh my Lanta! Oh god. Hurry, they're just like hugging on to you. Burn, burn it, burn all of it. Burn it? I keep hitting the wrong button. I still don't have much plasma cutter. The Wolverine Troy is getting I call him Mini Me. <laughs> Pour one out, one for me, and one for the homies. God, the fucking those movies are brilliant. Mole. Mole, 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 mole. Guacamole. <laughs> so funny. I'm gonna succumb in the world to the liquid hot magma. magma. <laughs> there are two things I can't stand in this world the Dutch. Or no. Shit, I fucked up the joke. There's two things I can't stand. People intolerant of other cultures and the Dutch. There we go. Second time's a charm. I feel like that those movies are something people either love or just fucking can't. Yeah, it's a type of comedy that probably doesn't appeal to everybody. There's like no there's no in between. It's just either 
Do you like it, Reed? Hey, and speaking of someone we talked about earlier in the Let's Play, Kevin Spacey, who plays Dr. Evil in the third one. They got a bunch of people. They fucking Tom Cruise and Kevin Peter, or Gwyneth Paltrow. And... and, of course, oh shit. The Vegas <laughs> get him at all. Danny DeVito is mini me. Hey, yeah. asshole! I'm mini me! They got like Woody Harrelson and all that, but all the little cutaway jokes and stuff, all these people. Woody Harrelson? Well, he wasn't in like a real, it was just like one of the, the big, the dick jokes. Oh, right, 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 right. That Sir, looks that like looks a like giant a giant Woody. Johnson. Yeah. Woody? Your your tent's ready. And then Ozzy shows up. Yeah. I don't know. I remember. Yeah, where he's like, why do we keep doing these stupid oh, cutaways? Oh, so this like is <laughs> this is where we stopped, I guess. Pink. Because that saved looked exactly like the save below it. Yep. So we did it in 30 minutes faster. You're welcome, everybody. And we died four times. Oh, uh, okay. Well, let's not remember that part of it. For my life, can't say that, girl. Don't tell me you can say that shit. All she want is payback for the way I always play that shit.